Tom Brady's innocent. That's how I feel about that. TB, uh, let me free my mans, dog. Y'all niggas acting crazy. I am Cousin Stiz, your favorite cousin, but you probably already knew that one. That's my little homie's name, uh, Damone Clark. We used to call him Mondo all the time, so I told him before he was going to pass that I was going to name the tape after him and do that shit for him, so that's what I did. It's been fun, bro. I mean, it's been, a, it's been work, but it's been fun. There's been a lot of, like, same shit that I've been doing, but just more amplified, more honed in, you feel me, and just trying to get deeper with the shit. That's pretty much what I tried to do with this, this last one, which is going to, like, do what I did in Suffolk County, but get a lot deeper into the cuts, tell a lot more stories and stuff like that. I feel like, you know, I just still make music for the homies. I, I bring my music back to the homies. They always get the first listen and tell me if my shit's trash or not, you feel me? Shout out to the internet. And that's a beautiful thing when it's used correctly. I just came in the crib, it was super late. I just came in the crib, it was like 2.33 in the morning. I get a DM from uh, Q, shout out Quinn, uh, Max manager. And uh, it was just this video, it was like, yo, this is crazy, bro. And it was just an Instagram video, I opened in this Drake, fuck with my shit, you feel me? And it was, it was a surreal moment, bro. But it just told me I had to work harder, you feel me? I had to keep that shit up, or that really goes nowhere other than a shout out, you know what I'm saying? So that's it, it's just, just try to get better, try to beat myself. Free my mans, y'all. TB didn't do none of that, man, come on, dog. We just get dubs, we don't, we don't worry about that shit. Get me stressed out. <laughs>